Welcome to this overview of the new and improved marketing automation capabilities within Ascendix RE. In listening to our customers and their needs around email marketing, we have evolved our tools to empower the broker like never before to target market at scale and increased efficiency. There were several challenges we have solved revolving around the following themes. An over-reliance on an admin or corporate marketing to create and send emails on the broker's behalf. Complexity in having to switch from a SendixRE to MailChimp to create and send emails. Reliance on synchronization of contacts between Salesforce and MailChimp before a contact can be included in an email send. Constantly having to update existing email templates with new or updated property data to ensure the latest information is sent to the target audience. Accidentally sending emails with stale or out-of-date data. Spamming people due to the inability to filter records into more targeted subgroups. Inability to assemble extemporaneous target groups for email sends. Inability to send emails to non-traditional record types like inquiry records. Limits to audience sizes being too low to accommodate larger campaigns. Let's see how this new enhanced marketing functionality works with Ascendix Search and Composer powered by MailChimp. In order to send a targeted and data-specific email within Ascendix RE, we need to define three things. Who are we sending the email to? What property-related data we want to include in the email? and what email template we want the data to be presented in. In most cases, we will start by defining the target audience. Using Ascendix Search as an advanced audience builder, we are able to increase the precision of the target groups to which we want to send emails. This includes using previously saved lists of contacts or defining specific criteria for a new target audience and sending an email to that group without having to save that list first. Here we will perform a search for those contacts that are related to office leases that are going to expire no later than 18 months from today's date and are located within a relative distance from downtown Dallas. Now that we have the target list filtered down, we'll launch the MailChimp wizard. Here we can select the target audience we want to send the email to, which in this case is all records matching the search criteria. We'll click the Next button to define what data we want to include in the email as well as the email template. In this use case, we are sending a property flyer for an office property that has availabilities matching the prospective tenant's profile. We'll select the object type of property and then select the specific property which in this case is Preston Park Financial Center. Next. We'll select a property flyer template to include the data in, and then select Next. Lastly, we'll give the email a subject line, and then click Send. The email and the target audience have now been sent to MailChimp for delivery. Here is a look at the email that is sent out. Another scenario that is supported involves the selection of the property-related data you want sent in the email prior to selecting the target audience. In this use case, I want to send an email including any office properties that are in the Dallas area that have available space greater than 10,000 square feet. Once I've got the filtered set of properties, I then launch the MailChimp wizard. I then select the audience I want to send the email to which is my prospective tenants list. I then click the next button which confirms the records that I have already selected to be included in the email. Now all that is left to do is select the proper email template. I then click next, include a subject line, click send, and the email is sent to MailChimp for delivery. Here is another quick glimpse of a multi-property oriented email using Ascendix RE with MailChimp integration. This is just a quick glimpse at what we've delivered in this enhanced marketing automation feature powered by MailChimp. Reach out to our sales department or contact your Ascendix account manager for more details. We look forward to discussing this new functionality with you.